Yo, what's going on, you guys? It is Scott Rayleigh here. I wanted to reach out to you all and hopefully get a fix for my Cydia Impactor. I'm currently running into this error called Provision. As you can see here on my screen, CP81, CSR7460. And believe it or not, after doing my research, I'm not the only one who's been going through this issue here. And I happen to have an iPhone 7, and I have um i've had it jailbroken now for the last week and a half you know and i lost my jailbroke because after seven days if you're not aware um it's like armageddon you know it's seven days your jailbreak is lost and then you have to load up um yalu again and during this process which i'll show you here in a minute um my my city impactor it's not uh allowing the yalu to create a profile under device management and there is a bunch of workarounds on the internet. Uh, people put workarounds, you know, like um, revoking your certificate access. Or another method is to install it as a different kind of way, right? And there's so many people out there just like me that will say something like this, nothing has worked, no matter how many method, method two, method three, method four. And um, so, Basically, you know, we, we've tried everything. We've run into the same problem over and over again. So I'm going to go ahead and launch my um, Cydia Impactor here and bring it over on the screen so you can go ahead and see it here. So here's my Cydia Impactor. You can see that I, I'm connected. I'll go ahead and I'll unplug my phone and then I'll plug my phone back in. And you'll see here in a minute, um, my phone's going to connect here. Okay, here we are. And one of the first things that they have you do um, is try to install it with um, by going here to install package. So we're going to hit install package. We're going to go ahead and click on the Yalu jailbreak. I'm going to go ahead and put in my email address, and then I'll put in my password here. And it usually goes to this step right here. Here we go. Provision 81 ios submit development csr equals 7460 you already have a current ios development certificate or a pending certificate so the articles all tell you to um revoke access revoke the access right like right here revoke the certificates under xcode okay so we're going to go ahead and do that we're going to go ahead and leave this open and go to xcode here and hit delete okay so i'm going to go ahead and put in my information again and what it will do is it'll say revoke zero certificates so it's literally not finding anything anyway so it's not even working so no matter what i do you guys i drag it over I do this, I do that. What should happen next is you should be able to go to your cell phone and then go under settings under general and then find in their device management, which you will then activate your Yalu. And then you should be able to um, then jailbreak your phone using the, um, you know, the, the match portal, the portal that, that you're given on your phone. Basically it, install, it installs a portal where you can then go ahead and use Cydia on your phone. So uh, as you can see that this is a process that was working uh, for me. This was working for me um, a, a week or so ago, and I lost it um, because after seven days you lose it. So now I'm trying to reload uh, it to get my jailbreak working again. Um, I don't have a problem if I have to load every seven days. I love having a jailbreak on phone. You know, I got all the cool apps, all the cool uh, tweaks and all the cool, you know, just like one of them alone is the YouTube plus plus. I love the YouTube plus plus. I also love having the ability to tether my phone to my iPad. And if I go to the tether my phone on my, you know, without a jailbroken, it'll say like, oh, pay this much money or you can't do that, you know. And so having a jailbroken, you can, you know, bypass all these different, you know, problems that you would have not jailbroken. So it really is a beautiful thing so i just wanted to go back to normal and uh, have more fun with you know 
having a jailbroken phone. There is really no other way out to have an iPhone besides having it <laughs> jailbroken. And I hope you feel the same way. So if you have um, a fix or if you know a friend that's really good at, you know, geeking out on this stuff, um, let him know that, hey, you know, this guy, he can't seem to get it working. And if you guys know someone who can help me out, get past this process. Because the methods that they're giving me aren't working. And this whole two-factor identification thing, authentication, I, I have that turned off. I don't even have that turned on. And a lot of the stuff that they talk about here, I, I don't have any problems logging into my Apple ID or anything. So I'm not sure why they even have this on here. And I don't have the two-factor authentication. So. Um, this is definitely a, a problem that a lot of people are experiencing. So I'm hoping this video can get the attention of some folks who can then, you know, find a problem and, and give an update. Here. So uh, thank you so much. And uh, you guys have a blessed day. Bye-bye.